Hi, I'm Kelly Woods. And I'm Roger Moore. You know, as two practitioners who help our clients deal with um, the diagnosis of cancer, we often get inquiries from our colleagues, from fellow hypnotists, who want to know exactly how do we do this. And we'll get those in the form of texts or emails. And here's one that came in recently, Roger. Dear Kelly and Roger, I met with a 76-year-old man today who had prostate cancer in surgery about 12 years ago. He's impotent and incontinent. Can hypnosis help him? Well, that's a, a excellent question, Kelly, and, and it's a, a fairly common one that I've received over the years from, from men. And, and my first response um, across the board is, uh, I just simply say, I don't know. Because that's the honest truth. I don't know. And then I followed up by saying, but yes, I do believe hypnosis can help in many ways. Uh, it can help with stress reduction. It can help uh, alleviate uh, any negative thoughts and, and improve self-image. I make sure that I never promise uh, a cure or healing and um, that I, I talk about alleviation of, of symptoms. And then I go on and, and ask some questions about you know, often on how long ago was the surgery. In this case, I think you said it was about 12 years ago. Uh, because today the, the surgery is much less invasive and, and um, damage to the body is much less extensive than it was 10, 12 years ago. So they've, they've come a long ways in, in uh, minimizing side effects. And what I've experienced over the years from in the feedback from the men that I have worked with uh, is that yes, uh, they can uh, start gaining bladder control again and have less in incidences. And, and uh, I've had men that have gone from having to, to wear Depends to um, being free of Depends. And often more importantly to the guys is being able to uh, uh, have an erection and maintain an erection and, and have intercourse. And uh, that uh, has happened in, in numerous occasions where uh, they just simply couldn't do it. And um, so yes, it is possible. And, but I make very clear when, when somebody asks me that question that I'm not going to promise them any results. And all we can do is go in and do the work and, and um, do the best we can. And, and I just want to be very clear about that. Of there's no magic cure and, and never ever promise uh, somebody that they're going to be free of depends and, and uh, be able to have intercourse. Great. I love your answer. And I, I think that that's not only very practical, but ethical. And at the very least, we know that we can reduce the suffering that someone like this is going through, right? Yes, absolutely. Yeah. And so, Roger, we're going to be sharing lots of great tips like this and providing some tools at our upcoming Seattle training. Do you want to talk about that? Well, Kelly, I, I'm just thrilled and excited and, and very honored to, to have the opportunity to, to share this time with you because you and I are offering a cancer care support training and uh, it's hypnosis as a, as a mindfulness approach and, and it's October 8th and 9th. Um, it's going to be live in Seattle so people can come to the Medical Dental Building in downtown Seattle and, and attend there. People can watch worldwide uh, live online and also uh, both people who attend uh, uh, live as well as, as uh, uh, in Seattle or online are going to be able to watch uh, the streaming video recording anytime they want so, and as many times as they want. So there's, there's three ways to, to participate. And it's October 8th and 9th. And, and there's a link here in the chat box on, on where people can uh, find out more details and, and register for the class. Awesome. I'll see you there. Okay. I'm looking forward to it, Kelly.